right, tonight we have a featherweight title fight with uh, the champion, Ronzik, defending his belt against Lawrence Dennis. And uh, Ronzik is a really just one of the most experienced guys that's still fighting on the amateur circuit. The guy could easily go pro now. He's got the skills. Uh, he's a really lengthy guy with amazing jiu-jitsu and a pretty stiff jab. And he will be taking on uh, Lawrence Dennis. Yeah, Lawrence, he's uh, he's another one of those tricky southpaws, man. He's uh, I know he's done. He's, he's got great stand-up. He's done a lot of tough man competitions. I believe he's done five tough man competitions and one or five. He's, he's just got that real awkward southpaw style. He's had a lot of fights. He's got great experience. I know he likes to keep it standing, but he's pretty well-rounded. You know, I've trained with him you know, a fair bit. Um, this is going to be a great fight. I believe um, Lawrence has got it standing up, and I believe Adam has, has got it on the ground with his great jit. Going to the ground with uh, Adam Ronsick is always dangerous. Yeah, he's been the champ for almost a year now. Yeah. He, he, he's, uh, he, he struggles to find fights because he's, uh, he's, he's got so much experience. He, it's, it's hard for him to fight. And he's pretty much fought everybody around. <laughs> yeah, definitely. He's pretty much fought everybody he can fight. Some of them twice, I think. You know, I want to see him use his reach, though. I always see him out here, and I feel like he could do a little more with his reach. He is a very tall fighter for 145. Yeah, Lawrence, Lawrence kind of stuck him down a little bit. Just Hands low. There it is. Nice there it is. Right. He got, he got. Oh! Right. oh. <laughs> that ignited a fire in Ronzik here. That's what it was. Ronzik, he drags you to the ground. He drags you. Look at this. Look at that. He pulled himself up using his leg and his arm. That's amazing. Now, he has one leg over the shoulder. It's going to be hard to lock that in. I think he's going to try and get him to fall. Excellent, excellent. He's getting that triangle this is a, tweaked a, up. A reverse triangle. Hmm. Rods are so calm and methodical here. He needs, he needs to switch. Switch the legs. Switch those legs. Uh, I don't know. If, is his right arm out or is it going to end? No, he's actually, he threw it over whenever he climbed up. And that was an amazing move. He's going to have to, like you said, switch the leg position, but I think he's trying to get him in a in just a place where he can lock him down on the ground right now. It would be about impossible to switch the leg position with the way uh, uh, Dennis has him just stacked up up against the cage or grinding his head into the cage. Is he going for the arm? I can't really see. Why aren't you over there? <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, he's, he's going, going for the arm. He's going for the arm. Yes, he is. Look at that flexibility, bro. That guy is so oh, amazing. Uh, this could be it. He needs to squeeze those knees together to get that cinched up top. He's trying to wedge that leg in there, like Brandon said. He's trying to get him a little bit closer, but it's hard. Lawrence has him packed in there tight. That's a six foot man crammed into a two foot box right now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he is not letting go of the arm. This is why Adam is so dangerous. Ten yeah. seconds left, I think. He will sit here. He will absorb this damage until you make a mistake while you're trying to hurt him, and he will capitalize on your mistake and submit you. This is a lot like a Trey Singleton fight. And he locked in a submission half. There we go. There we go. He's locked in. Into it. You don't think he's got the elbow in. Now he's gonna have to adjust and get it tighter. But the way Dennis is kind of stacking in there still. He may have sucked it back in. I see the arm bent a little bit. Yeah, he's not, yeah. <laughs> trying to, I guess, wiggle his arm out of there. so calm still after eating those big shots. No. What? I don't know what that was, but. <laughs> Rock and suck and robots on the ground here. Oh, again. Big shot, shot, big shot. 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 Don't play in that game. Don't play that game with Adam. No. Adam can throw that leg over and get that triangle if he comes in too hard. He's done it before. If I'm right, if I'm right, I'm separating, just standing back up. You had a lot of success with the stand-up earlier. Oh, good heavy bombs. bombs. Good heavy bombs in the first round.
So Warren State has still did a, a good bit of damage, but on a veteran like Johnson, uh, you gotta worry if that's even gonna carry over to the next round. I like how uh, he was in trouble a lot in that round, but he, he managed to, to just stay just out of danger. He almost gave it up a few times, and you can't make mistakes like that with a rocket. Very impressive ground and pound at the end, though. Yeah. Someone yeah, yelled Hulk smash. <laughs> yeah, with some, some big shots, so. Lawrence with uh, Alan Hedgehog Greenway and Roger Carl in this corner there, so he's definitely All right, here we go, round number two. Oh, oh. That's what you said about that chin. That he hits the ground. He's he hits the ground. back in it. Oh, he's ready. Ready to go. Oh, oh. Lawrence is being smarter now and not engaging Lawrence on the ground, taking away his biggest tool and uh, leaving him in, in, in his biggest area, which is the stand up here. Big shout to the body chest going on right now. Right, right, I Big shots, but God, determination, willpower on this guy. Looks like he's trying to round up something on an uh, leg lock here. He's trying to spin out. Adam wants his fight solely on the ground. He does not want any part of this standing up. I like how he locks people down like that. It's a very odd form of, uh, I, I guess it's like modified rubber guard. But uh, he locks him down to control the posture. It's a good way of him uh, not taking any damage as well while he's on the bottom. He's got both his arms locked up. Both the arm bar again. You notice Adam actually has his arm. He uh, gets stuck in his legs, yeah. May I say that again? Choke. He's choking, yeah. Good call, Brady. What is that called? Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh. oh. All right. Sneaky. Adam has pulled off some of the craziest submissions I've ever seen. I've seen him already trying to remain unconscious on his back and pulled out a coveted fighting championship. He's very surprised. patient, he's just sneaking his arm a little bit further, a little bit deeper. Every go. second's making it nice and deep. I'm gonna be honest, I'm gonna go train with him to get Break this. It out of he's he's using go. his own calf and forearm to choke on the tennis it. here. Get up on the go, 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 move! Has anyone ever seen anything like that, obviously? No. <laughs> no, this is, uh... Thank he needs to switch off and go to the arm. Keep that leg! Oh, I mean, look at his face right now, but he is choking pretty good. I'm not sure how to tighten that up. What do you do? That is tough. You extend your leg, I guess. Adam, you gotta get angry, buddy, go! This is the craziest oh, 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 back into the triangle, Joe. Wow. Adam Rossi, a submission machine here tonight. He's gonna have to finish this quick, though. There's not long left in the round. He's, he's got uh, the that's a good solid triangle right there. He's got the angle. That's a good solid triangle. Really needs to grab a hold of the back of that head and pull it down. Why is he grabbing the arm? He needs to grab the head. 
Yeah, it's loosened up. Oh, he loosened it up. He's starting to get some swelling, or swelling underneath his uh, left eye. You notice every round ends with him getting pounded on. Uh, and he gets right back up and walks to his corner. Like nothing happens. I wonder if he gets the man that submission since I've never seen anything like that in my life. It looked like the attack was sort of like a, like a go-go bottle when you're yeah. sleeping under it. But he, <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, it looks like he exerted a lot of energy trying to finish that off. Yeah. Oh, be interested to see how it tolls out in the third round. I love you. Just for the night. Just for the night. I love her too. Lawrence did a, a great job at staying from Bozo and uh, just took it out. I mean, he, his face was red, the veins were sticking out on his head. It might look like a fun place to be. That crazy, crazy, I don't know. Ron, Ronza Plata, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> and then he went straight to a triangle, a very tight triangle from there. Four is locked. That's it. Third round. Let's go. This is a good title fight. This is a good fight. Oh, he is tired. Adam is tired. Oh. He does not need to throw that kick. No. Oh, uh, 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 uh. You just kind of fell into that. Yeah, he's going to force him to stand up and fight his fight. Looks like he slowed down a little bit, but, oh. but he's still got that power. A lot more, guys. Uh -oh. This is not good. Good head movement. You need to move. Back. He took that without a mouthpiece. <laughs> he needs to get his back off that cage to get center of the ring. You know, I think he's actually almost hoping Dennis to drop him, try to follow him to the ground, and Ronzik has a chance of tapping him out again. Because his shot is shot. Yeah. You know, we've seen a lot of heart and determination, but taking shots like that. Adam Rodgers has been doing this for 37 fights, fighting almost exactly like this in every fight. There haven't been a lot of fights that he's been in where he's the front runner, he's destroying somebody. It, it's a lot of comeback victories. You love to watch this guy fight. He needs to throw something instead of just walking in with that, that head down. He's walking in, eating punches. Such a lengthy fighter, you think that the jab would be a viable option at this point. Just some jabs, Adam. And he is breathing heavily. Lawrence needs to throw something more than the jab. He can put together like a three punch combo right now as slow as Adam is moving. He can put him away. Playing it small, they just, they just want to get dragged to the ground again. Oh! See, Adam throws the jab, a nice stiff jab, and it lands. He needs to use that reach more often, like that. Oh! And he's still up. And he's still up. Oh my God. I think it's about to be a ref stoppage. <laughs> Oh, this is amazing. Excellent. Hit with a spinning back fist and keeps pressing forward. This is an insane fight. Oh, wow. Don't get that head down. I don't know. He just told Adam to fight back. Did you see that? I don't know how to do this. You start off a fight and I have to say that. You know, with that head, I would not think he has this amazing chin that he does. <laughs> I wouldn't think so. He doesn't know he's built for this much punishment. But, <laughs> God, he has taken it. Wow. 
needs to dodge that one there. He needs to, he needs to try for a, a diving heel hook or something. Anything, Adam. <laughs> Anything. You can't help but pull for this guy. You Give know, me I mean, something. This is like a, a Hollywood movie every time he oh. fights. Oh, oh, oh. God. Still us. Oh. He is off. He's going in for teeing off. Unbelievable. Oh, is this a five round fight? Oh, this is the right four minute rounds. Two more rounds. Still two more rounds. Two more four minute rounds. Oh, oh, oh. Two more four minute rounds. That, that, that is impressive. I didn't thought that fight was over. I think he did too, the way he helped him out. I don't know that. That spinning back fist, where did that come from? Bloody hell. Oh, that was nice. <laughs> That was that's touche, Lawrence. That is touche. That was really just Adam being a punching bag for that entire round. But you got to give it up for a guy who's he's got nothing left in the tank, and he is still coming forward trying to get a takedown. I remember halfway through game. Uh, uh, they just called it. Oh, uh, is it? No. Yeah, it's it. Congratulations. Yeah, as exciting as it is to see Adam fight like that, it's it's got to take its toll on his body. He is 35 years old. I just now saw him. Yeah, yeah, 35 years old. Wow. I'm pretty sure everybody that booed him on the way in is eating their own words right now. Telling him, yeah, my hand hurts. Okay. <laughs> yeah, he's, he's, he's okay. looking down there. coming out of Lawrence's hand, he's just tired of, uh, oh, just get Adam a pat on the back and you see all the blood, and you see the blood on the flag there. Uh, no, he did not break his hand. Maybe that's from uh, Adam's nose and some of oh, the blood. Yeah. 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 You break your hand bad enough you're bleeding, that's, yeah. that could be at least a year out. Well, he's got a big, uh, shiny golden thing to hold on to if you, uh, <laughs> keep your company while you're here. Let's go. First of all, and foremost, congratulations, you are a new Broadway title holder. Now, Mr. Austin was definitely by far the most experienced fighter that's ever stepped in the game. How did you get past all that experience? It looked like you might have been in trouble there in round number two. Did you have everything under control or was you worried? Uh, both. I, uh, he had a good, he had tight position in and I, I was ready to go, but I just couldn't, couldn't, and I wasn't going to pass. Well, now, I mean, you got some, uh, experience in ring two. You're approved to 64 now. What's up next for the Matrix? I'm not gonna have this title long because next month I'm turning pro. So uh, July 6th for Freedom Fighter, we're making my pro debut. Uh, so it's good to be in the champ for however long, for a couple weeks. Well, good job, did not know that. Congratulations. That's the last of your amateur fights right here for the Lord. The Matrix Dennis, July 6th, is it? Yes, sir. Do 
going to be turning pro, fighting the first fight for freedom. We'll be looking forward to seeing who you want to thank out there. Uh, thank everybody at Body Quest, MMA, um, Believe the Hype, because uh, we got three more title fights coming up off from us, our, our gym, so hopefully we go 4 0 tonight. And uh, just everybody help me get, get ready for this fight. Well, thanks a lot. Congratulations. Yeah, we have a, a crazy, typical Adam Ronda performance of him taking a lot of damage, almost landing a, a crazy, a true, for the record books, a submission attempt. Lawrence weather the storm, walks away with a very impressive win.